This next project is an Ikea hack where I basically took these wooden cutting boards and I measured an inch in on each of the corners and I marked the inch in spot. That way we can know where we're going to be drilling our holes later because we are going to be turning this into a hanging shelving unit. And this project turned out so cute. I love the way that it turned out in the end. So I just went ahead, brought these pieces outside and used a drill bit that was wide enough for the rope material that we're going to be using here. So as you can see, I got this rope here at the Home Depot. It is a simple nylon rope. And the first thing that I did was I grabbed two pieces of my rope and I folded it in half at the very middle point and I tied it in a knot as shown here. Next, what I did was I measured down about 18 inches from our knot and I just made a little marking on our piece because that is exactly where we're going to be tying our knots on each section. Now, the knot is what's going to be holding our shelf in place. So you're actually going to want to make sure that all of your knots are in a very similar spot. That way your shelf is very level and it's not off center because if you have knots that are hanging lower on one side, your shelf is then going to hang lower on one side as well. So using a ruler, measure down about 12 inches, make a marking, and just make sure that you tie your knot in the same spot once again. The great thing about this project is you can totally adjust the knots as needed. They're not anything that is super tight, and once the shelf actually sits on top of the knot, it kind of tightens itself naturally. You can hang this up and enjoy your new hanging shelf.